I'm going to show you how to make 200,000 nanites just using the freighter, just in few minutes. I actually found out I never made video for this, but now it's the time. I made video last year on how to make nanites farm pretty quick, and I showed you how to make 10,000 nanites or 15,000 nanites in 20 minutes, and to be honest with you, it's still kinda slow. You might notice in all my videos, I always have so many nanites to be able to upgrade the ship or multi-tool or whatever it is. I never showed how I do it, and I don't do the old way anymore. So how do I do it using the freighter? There is actually some requirement to be able to do it. You will need to have a freighter. You don't have to get the same one as I am, you can use any freighter, capital or normal freighter. You need to have good multi-tool for mining damage. I already have Atlantid multi-tool. It is the best multi-tool for mining damage. We need to go to the multi-tool upgrade. And we need to make sure we unlock the advanced mining laser. And we need to make sure we unlock the optical drill. We need to install on the multi-tool advanced mining laser. Just one second. And we need to install optical drill. You guys know already, the runaway mold it is the best way making nanites. I'm going to show you on runaway mold the new way I do it, and I'm going to show you other item, it is the fastest way making nanites as well. Right now we need to find the runaway mold. As you guys know, the runaway mold you can find it on most of the planet. That's actually one of my planet. It have hundreds of area for runaway mold. You guys know you can find the runaway mold using the exocraft. The almost everywhere on every planet. It called Curious Deposit. That's the runaway mold. That's a planet it have almost 100 bases. You can see how many bases already. The glyph for it right here. It's inside Euclid Galaxy. Most of us know about the runaway mold before, but what is the idea about the runaway mold? We don't need the refiner anymore. The goal here is get much as you can runaway mold. We need to make about 50 stack of them. I can just do it quickly. And after you destroy them, you need to create save from your ship. And you need to reload again. And when you come back, you will find this runaway mold that came back right here. We can just collect them right away. You can spawn them back by just reloading as I showed you. Or you can just go far away and come back, they will spawn again. Or you can just teleport to another base and come back again. There is a lot of amazing people build the base on this planet. Let's go to this one. The more curious deposit in the area, the better. The view looks absolutely awesome. And you can see so many runaway mold here. This area is so much better than my base. I can just farm them quick right here, that's actually pretty good, not gonna lie. All I have to do is collect much as I can runaway mold. I will get you back when I get about 50 stack. The optical drill it give you 50% more resources. But inside the super charged, you get 88%. If you want the same multi tool and the freighter, I'm going to leave it down in description. Are you guys okay? What is happening to the graphic? On this base, it didn't really take more than 3 minutes, but I think I got enough right here. Right now, we need to go to our freighter. We need to visit our freighter right here. I miss you, boy. Right now we need to go on upgrade control on the freighter and we need to unlock the refiner room. The only different about it, you can only install 3 medium refiner on the planet and 3 larger refiner. But on the freighter, it is different story. You can install much as you can refiner room on the freighter. I can install many as I want here. Let's install one right there. Let's install more. Right now, you can just put the runaway mold inside the each refiner and you can turn it to nanites. 
That's the way you can get much as you can in nights just in few minutes. You guys can see I have all the refiner working. You can see the runaway mold it's not the best way. It take 20 minutes to finish, which is kinda a lot of time in my opinion. I don't want to wait 20 minutes. There is actually better way and faster. Let's go here. Is refine the Highland Brain. You can get in 2 minutes 2300. You guys know you can get the brain from the sentinel camp for getting the sentinel ship. This actually is the fastest way I found making the knights. I didn't know about the brain before. I found out from the amazing friend Subquick. Subquick is the creator of mod Undead Legacy. It's a very famous mod on game called 7 Days. It's actually a zombie game. Big thanks to Subquick for telling me about it. All the amazing credit go to Subquick for this amazing information. And that's how you make 200,000 nights using the freighter. That's the way you don't have to use the normal refiner anymore. I would like to know down in comment what do you think about this? And is that the best way for you making the nights or you have other way? If you want to get the best Atlantid multi tool for making the nights, make sure to watch this video, it will show you how. I love you guys and have a wonderful day.